Did I miss something? When did we get to Disneyland? Hello everyone, I'm Edumacated, and welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound for Super Nintendo Entertainment System. Where am I? Maybe uh, Star Master can help me here. Ness, you stood on the eight power spots of the Earth. From these you created Magicant, the realm of your mind. In Magicant, there's beauty, kindness, sorrow, and hatred. Of course, there's an evil and violent side of you. The Sea of Eden sits at the center of those feelings. It takes you to the truth about yourself. Hmm, ominous. So if we go over here, we've got our dog. I lived in your house before you were born. Ness used to be small and weak. And now he is big and strong, and in his jammy jams. Chee -chee 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 -chee. On it was a quiet small town, wasn't it? Yes, it was. Hey, everything's back to normal again. Awesome. Uh, this is the realm of Magicant. Excuse me, which your mind created. Why don't you explore your mind? Take your time, Ness. <gasps> it's Everdread. Ness! Maybe you don't want to hear this, but you remind me of myself when I was young. I can't do anything more for you. Good luck, Ness. And away he goes. So maybe that means Everdread truly is gone. Oh well. Ness, did, did you learn how to tell what a time I'm indicating? <laughs> Look at the sun. Face the sun and smile. Yay! I'm smiling! <laughs> anyway. If we go into the shop... Hi! This shop specializes in puddings and pendants! You'd like to buy some, wouldn't you? Sure. What do you want to buy? I like how everything is uh, has a question mark and an exclamation point on it. He's real. He really wants to sell me stuff here. So we'll buy this earth pendant. Earth pendant? Oh, thank you. Do you want to equip it in the store? Yes. Shall I buy your rain pendant for fifteen hundred? Uh, not yet, because I want to know what else I can do with that. Uh, anything else I can do for you? No, thank you. We'll give this to Tracy to hold on to, so that way she can take this back to the real world with her. Snow Eden is at the end of Magic Hand. Other people can't get close to it. It's a strange place. Yes, it is. So, we'll store the rain pendant. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Thank you. Okay. So, yeah, let's uh, try to buy a couple of magic puddings for the road, because uh, this is the only place you're going to be able to get magic puddings, and magic puddings are pretty good. Like that balance, eleven seventy-seven eleven. It's it's like it's like trying to be lucky, and just overdid it completely. So we go back to this guy. We got some puddings we'd like to buy. Do I have enough for one more? Yes, I do. Uh, let's. The problem is I'm gonna have. No space for anything else. Yeah, cause well, cup. Yeah, you know what? Let's let's give Tracy that cup of life noodles, cause oh, hi, magic butterfly. That was just right there at the entrance. Nice to see you too. Thank you for making me relax. Appreciate it. I was running very low on uh, psychic power. Yeah, let's give this uh, cup of life noodles to uh, to Tracy to hold on to, because let's face it, I'm by myself, and if I die, that's it. So we'll do that. No, nope, that's it. Take care, and I'll talk to you later. Yes, we'll see you later, Tracy. See you. See you back when the world is is normal again. <laughs> Come on in the Magic Ant. Except you can't because it's only Ness's world. Oh, there's a zombie here. You kicked my butt badly. I won't forget. Hmm. Okay. Let's talk to somebody more cheerful, like uh, Master Belch. You destroyed my pride. <laughs> Pleasant, wonderful. Let's uh, go talk to somebody that's a little bit better for me. It's me. I'm you when you were younger. Hey, let's play ball. Do you prefer pl reading comics or playing games? I prefer playing comics and reading games, if you don't mind. What? You're busy? Yeah. 
I'm busy saving the world. Thank you for remembering me. Just this lowly snowman. Hey, it's Magic Ant! <laughs> I'd like you to take your time. Yeah, the other rabbits told me to do that, too. Because this country will disappear when you wake up. <gasps> it's like Link's Awakening. Let's see. If I, did I look in here? There's a TV. No problem here. How about you? Please rest. The dream you'll have here is a dream within a dream. We must go deeper. Your heart knows things you aren't aware of. Do you want to sleep? Yes. <laughs> the dream you had was very strange and confusing. It was almost as if you were back in Foresight again. Oh, God. I know the name of the girl you used to like. Well, don't tell Paula, because she'll probably go hunt her down or something. <laughs> something bad might happen. Wah! Ness. Let's play. Oh, it's Waluigi as a kid. <laughs> Wah! La 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 la. My name's Nico. Let's run and sing and dance. I hope you're not the girl I used to like, because, you know, you need to disappear. <laughs> well, then again, this is Magic Hand, so I guess you will. Gah! Gah to you, too. Long time no see, Ness. <laughs> Gah! That's how I'm going to start greeting people now. Gah! Ness, Pokey took my snack. I'll go beat him up for you. Fresh. Huh? Fresh. Fresh. Okay. Um. Okay. Yeah. For for those who don't know, I it's, it's time to actually live up to my uh, my my channel name. Um. This girl, what she's talking about is uh, this comes from the Japanese version of the game. Uh, in which Ness, being, you know, how he's existing in the world of the soul, uh, is completely naked. Yes. Yes, you heard me correctly. Um, it's just the whole Japanese thing of, you know, when you're when, when it's just your spirit walking around, they're completely butt naked. It's kind of like how uh, that one episode of uh, Penn & Teller uh, BS uh, talks about ghosts, you know, always being seen fully clothed and everything, and saying, How's the, how do the ghosts of uh, clothing... Uh, follow you around. I mean, you know, clothes don't have ghosts. I always thought it was just, you know, I always tried to explain it as just like, you know, well, that's what you, it's what your, you know, your consciousness or whatever is trying, is manifesting your identity or I don't know, whatever. I, I'm, I, I have no expertise in that. But anyway, so when you talk to this, this yellow haired girl, she, uh, in Japanese calls you, uh, Echi, I think it is, which is, of course, short for hentai, which is, of course, a, you know, the Japanese term for calling somebody a pervert. Because he's walking around naked. And, you know, this is Magic Can, so, you know, we're gonna screw with your head a little bit more, <laughs> I guess. Kya kya. Okay, doesn't have anything else to say other than that. Peace! We haven't played together lately. No, my name is not Peace, my name is Ness. But uh, thank you for, for playing. <gasps> Pokey. Ness, you're so lucky. I envy you. I have no luck. But Ness... Well, okay. Let's be friends forever, alright? How about no? You pig-nosed jerk. We had fun one snowy day. I melted, but I'm still real in your memory. Yeah, you are a little bit shorter than the other ones, aren't you? No, maybe not. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's just my imagination. So if we go up here... Hmm, there's a house with a grave marker. This is Buzz Buzz's tombstone. Buzz Buzz! <laughs> I haven't thought of you since, like, episode six or so. He appeared earlier in the game and gave up the ghost before he achieved his goal. Well, that's not a nice thing to say. I mean, he, he, he got flattened by a by a portly middle-aged woman. What do you want from him? <laughs> oh. Oh. I like this music. So there are these guys flying. You know, flying, not really flying around. They're kind of walking around, though. But we could talk to one. I am your courage. I follow you here in Magic Hunt. My name? Let's say Flying Man. The uninspiredly named Flying Man joins you. Actually, he doesn't really fly at all either. He just kind of walks around. 
Of course, his music persists as he's following me, too, which is cool. Nice. I still feel pain where you wounded me. Hmm. Let's go find a more pleasant thing to person to person thing man to talk to before we go on out there. Um, let's talk to the rabbit. I'd like you to take your time because it's... there we go. Yeah, turn the lights back on. The Sea of Eden is filled with ultimate intelligence. You can't go there unless you're truly ready. It's a place where you can touch the truth of the universe. Going there may bring sorrow. Hmm. And a change in the background music, too, apparently. So, let's see. Over here is... Me? Hey, me! I found my cap that you lost. Ness got the baseball cap. Which I actually don't think that... Yeah, that's like... It's like crappy. <laughs> I'm gonna lose it again, you know. As soon as I get a, an opportunity. Uh, oh no, more, more attacking gift boxes. I hate attacking gift boxes, and it's a loaded dice. Ooh. Called for help. The carefree bomb. Oh crap. Uh, let's see, I don't have anything to deal with that, do I? Oh, I do. Stop calling for help! That's that's the thing the loaded dice does. Mm. There, all right. And I think yeah, next next target's got to be the uh, the carefree bomb. Oh. Yeah, and you cannot heal flying the flying man. Oh, flying man just had enough of everything. He is done. He has had enough. Uh oh, come on, come on, flying man, hold on. Hang on there. We got this. Ooh, that was a lot. Level 63, offense up by two, vitality up by one, luck up by one, HP up by 13, PP up by two, nice. I like it. So yeah, as far as I know, there's no way to uh, restore flying man's health. Unless there's like some outside influence that can that can heal you. Oh god, not another one of those guys. No thank you. Let's try over here. There's another gift gift box. There's ooh, a goddess band, yes. <laughs> Look at that. That is some good stuff. Let's go let's go sell off that diamond band real quick. You encounter the Electro Swoosh. The Electro Swoosh is actually probably your easiest encounter in this whole game. Sends a greeting first. He's so polite and nice. With his lightning bolts coming out of his eyes. But yeah, I don't think the uh, the electric shock attacks will hit anybody but Ness. And since Ness still has the Franklin badge, it's not going to hurt. Booyah! Right back at you. Or XP. No, no, not another one of these guys. Mm. Okay, it's an electro swoosh. That's that's the good news. Ooh! <laughs> and it's another electro swoosh. <laughs> the first electro swoosh sends a greeting and like, good lord, dude, that hurt. Okay, so this should be no problem. Mm. It still didn't kill him. All right, yeah, we're gonna. We're just pretty much gonna sit here and let these guys kill themselves. Ooh, wow, that was lucky of him. More or less. Didn't hit. Didn't hit. Okay. Okay, I figured that one was almost done. And that's the end of the other one. Excellent. You won! Look at that XP! Holy smoke! We like out leveling everybody here before uh, before long. 
I don't want to talk to any of you guys. You're depressing. You are depressing and you make the landscape dark and unhappy. So I will no longer talk to you. Let's uh, let's go inside here. Let's get rid of the... Let's sell off this diamond band. What do you want to sell? I want to sell that diamond band. Yes, it's deal. Thank you so much. Yes, indeed. So yeah, needless to say, this is going to have Ness out-level everybody by a lot. <laughs> the only other way I could see, like, trying to get everybody back up to, to like, even play, playing odds is uh, to just kill Ness off and then have everybody else level up somewhere. I don't know. Maybe over in Deep Darkness or Lost Underworld or something. And I don't think this will restore... Uh, flying man's HP either. It's unfortunate, you know. There's, I always wish that there was a way to uh, restore flying man's HP, but I don't think that there is. But I may as well completely freshen up before uh, heading back out again into the, into the Sea of Eden. Plus, we get to listen to this awesome music. <sighs> Another loaded dice. You're a loaded dice. You wanna summon carefree bombs. Mm. Okay, I'll take the hit. That's fine. I'll gladly take that hit. Mm. Hang on there, flying man. You can do it. No, flying man got hurt and collapsed. No, flying man. I need you. I need my courage. Ness is level 64. Oh, baby! Offense up by 4. Defense up by 2. Oh, baby! Guts up by 3. Maybe I don't need flying, man. IQ up by 2. Luck up by 1. HP up by 2. That rocks! PP up by 8. <sighs> Alas, poor flying, man. There's actually four more of them if I wanted to go back and get another one. But I don't need the help of a flying man when it's just an electrical swoosh. Electro swoosh. I should I should uh, I should address him by his proper name at least. Especially because he just gets punked out like this by his own electric attacks. <laughs> mm! Mm! Right in the eyes. Cuz that's all I've got to aim for, so, you know. That's 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 what I'm going to do. I think in that bag down there is a uh, bag of Dragonite, which is really nice. Hello, question mark. You're here all by yourself. It's the French kiss of death. Ugh. Don't slip me no tongue, bro. Yeah, yeah. Ah, disgusting. These lips. These lips are terrible. Yeah, and that's why I'm not bothering to uh, to recover that poison, just because they'll just get poisoned again. <laughs> All right. So another massive chunk of uh, XP. We shall heal, and we shall continue. Another electro swoosh. Ooh, and there's a there's a butterfly over there. Good. I want that butterfly. Sends a greeting. I send a bat to his face. If he had one. Oh, and another 120 back to you. Mm! Eat it! Eat it with some ketchup and mustard! And a little relish on the side. <laughs> I don't know why I suddenly started talking like a pirate. But I did. Do it one more time just for added giggles. There we go. Thank you, Magic Butterfly. This is why I have you around. There's a Magic Cant Bat inside. Ooh, that's got to be good. It's a Magic Cant Bat. It's a bat made from the from the very realm of my mind. This should be, yeah, you saw that. It was like 12, 12 points more of, uh, of power. Was this another friend? Oh, no. I only saw the one question mark. That's why I thought it was like another French kiss of death. These guys should be all right. 
with their with their funky funky background. Look at that. Ugh. That kind of hurts my eyes just looking at that. Ugh. Excuse me. Just gonna just gonna get by you here. Now another. Oh. Oh. Okay. There's a magic tart inside. I can buy those though. Oh. There's something up over there. Another question mark. It's uh, apparently a molecule because I just smashed it into the ground. Oh, hey, and I leveled up from that. 65, HP up by 2, PP up by 1. Hey! There you go. Let me guess. Three more molecules? Oh, no. three mole Two molecules and a carefree bomb. Let's get rid of that carefree bomb. Because he is more dangerous than anything these two guys would ever be. Just because the Earth Pendant is... Oh, that's bad. The Earth Pendant is pretty much like a, uh, you know, a lesser version of the Sea Pendant. Please be done. Oh, boy. Alright, I better heal up. <laughs> yeah, now they're able to concentrate, so that means they can actually use their attacks. But, like I said, I, I should be fairly well protected from these guys. Uh, that's bad. That's very bad, and I'm still... Not. Come on, come on, come on, quick, 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 Let's see, I still have all my stuff, though, right? Okay, good. Stupid carefree bombs. Those are, like, the worst enemies in the game, too. I'm going to sell my ultimate bat, because it is no longer the ultimate bat, because the magic hand bat is better. Yes. Yes. I'm also going to sell the baseball cap that, uh... Well, here, let's let's see if it says anything special here first, before we before we just callously throw it aside. It must be equipped as other. It has the logo of your favorite baseball team. Hmm. Cool. Let's sell it. Because it's not that good for me. <laughs> for nine bucks. <laughs> yeah, sure. Okay. Thank you so much. Um, oh, let's, yeah, let's, let's buy up another pudding. Alright. So now we must fast forward our way through, through all of this nonsense. And I'm going to have to go rest because all my PP got uh, completely annihilated because I died. Stupid carefree bombs. That's why I don't like carefree bombs. They suck terrible things that just constantly do nothing but throw bombs at you and do so much damage that it's unfathomable. Even with all the defense I've got. Yeah, out of the way, Pokey. I know you're not in my way, I don't care. Oh, there's a grave marker here. Ness's courage is resting here. He fought well and died. Mm. Yes, despite my best efforts. So, I'll be your courage. I'll remain unless you lose your courage. Call me Flying Man 2. Flying Man 2 joins you. Flying Man 2, Electric Boogaloo. Let's go, sequel to Flying Man. Okay, nothing's going to immediately jump me before I, uh... You know, yeah, I may as well go after this, uh, this other box over here. This other gift box. And, you know, why not fight through an electro swoosh? Sends a greeting! I send a bat! Mm. And that should probably clean him up. Yep. Ha! Got nothing. Alright. So this is a bag of Dragonite, which will be wonderful if I ever have to deal with that situation of Carefree Bomb and Mr. Molecules again. And the slowdown is amazing. Oh, God, no. Mm -mm, no. No! 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 <laughs> Leave me alone, you loaded dice! Uncontrollable Sphere is terrible, because that means that Flying Man won't be able to recover from any... Oh, good lord, really? Okay, became tame. I want to try to get away from these guys. I can't get away from these guys. Okay, good, good, good dodging there, Flying Man. Come on, let's get away from these things. Yes! Excellent. I was kind of hoping I could catch it by surprise, but I fell short of it. Alright, you. Mm. High class UFO. I can, I can accept that, I can live with that. That's fine. Because that does, he does minimal damage at this point in the game. I'm happy with that. Except when he does it to Flying Man, who doesn't have any defense. That's bad. Mm. Alright. Okay, yeah, this is kind of a stressful moment in the game, because loaded dice are just the worst enemies in the game. No more uncontrollable spheres, please! 
Try to get away and did. Good. Just don't want to deal with those because they're going to deal so much. Oh. Okay, there's a French kiss of death. Yeah, give, uh, give Flying Man the French kiss of death. See what happens. It did not work on the Flying Man because he has a beak and he doesn't have lips. Oof. Split that lip. Yes. 19,210. 19, We're just going to get away from that. Thank you. Hello there, Electrical Swoosh. Yeah, we don't kill you immediately, but that's fine. We'll, 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 we'll take a little extra. We'll take a little extra moment to get to know you before we destroy you completely. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Like it. Now let us run. Run. <laughs> run to the next Electro Swoosh because he is safer. He sends a greeting. I send 236 points of damage right back to him. Uh, mm. OJ. Actual orange juice, not, uh, not, not, not the, the former football player. And also former uh, co-star of the Police Files. Level 66. Offense up by one. Vitality up by one. Luck up by one. HP up by 11. PP up by two. That's all I got. Run. Ooh, butterfly. Butterfly in the sky. Heal my butt so high. <laughs> I don't know where that came from, but I don't care either. All right. Electro swoosh and a question mark. French kiss of death. Yeah, we'll kill. We'll, we'll take care of that first. Because electro swoosh is not scary at all. Just keep dealing those smash attacks. That's beautiful. I love every single one of them. Mm. And especially when I can double reflect the electrical attacks. This is, this is awesome. This is what I want. This is the revenge I've been seeking all of my life. Wow. And all that XP. I, I might hit level 70. I might. Okay, good. Got the jump. Um, yeah, let's just save a little bit of time here. Get out of that. Um, that is a magic tart, I think. It's a magic tart. Got too much stuff. Mm. Shame, really. That is a question mark inside of uh, of eyeballs, which is weird, but whatever. <laughs> you keep taking those French kisses of uh, of death there, uh, flying man. That's what that's what that's what you're here for. That's why I'm defending you with every last inch of my life. Sort of. I I, I actually can't. I can't defend you at all because it's all up to random chance. And smash attack splits open the lips of the French kiss of death and kills it completely. And we've got a reflected lightning attack and a, and another attack on top of that defeats the whole damn thing. I can't even keep talking. Thirty six thousand XP question mark by itself. It must be a molecule. Yep, it was a molecule. Alright, more molecules. Lots more molecules. Yep, four Mr. Molecules. It's like I'm, like I'm in science class or something. Flash, didn't work very well, didn't work very well, didn't work very well, didn't work very well. No, come on, guys, seriously? Oh, uh, yeah, my brain, my brain hurts now. Alright, well, Try this on for size. There you go. Add that up, boy flying man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm, mm. Didn't kill any of them. They're gonna start concentrating now, though. Alright, let's try to kill that one. Good. I gotcha. Mm hmm. That should be nothing. Yep, cool. Okay, he's done. And argh, into the end zone. Even though I've got a baseball bat. 67. Oh, baby! Offense up by 3, speed up by 1, IQ up by 1, HP up by 2, PP up by 2. Ooh, realize the power of Flash Omega. I have no idea if I'll even use it. Flash is kind of like a tricky... A tricky thing. Uh, to... To have to make work. Mm, that one's done. There we go, yeah! This is a lot better than that last fight. I mean, I guess... Mm, <laughs> I think we've had... I think the game's had enough. Uh, something's had enough here. I don't know. The RNG is saying, let, let him... Let him through now. Let him pass. Let us be anti. Let us be anti Gandalf. You shall pass. We're almost there. Oh. That's what I've been holding on to this thing for. Sprinkle the bag of dragonite over his head. Yikes! Turned into a gigantic fire-breathing dragon, and it still didn't kill the carefree bomb. Unfortunately, yeah, that only lasts for like one one round, which is which is wrong. But you know, whatever. All right, that helped. Um, let's see, am I already full up on life? Yes, I am. So, come here, Mag Mr. Magic Butterfly. This is actually a, a first for me. I don't think I've ever had a flying man accompany me to this area. The Sea of Eden. And what could live in the Sea of Eden but a kraken? Oh, Lord. I guess we have no choice but to fight it. There's no way I can juke him. The Kraken blocked the way. Mm. Ow. <laughs> and that's the end of Flying Man. Thank you for your help, Flying Man. Appreciate it. Uh. Mm. 
Okay, he's just gonna do nothing but breathe fire, and I'm just gonna keep trying to bash his face in! There we go. That was for you, Flying Man 2. Level 68. Oh, baby! Offense up by three. Oh, baby! Defense up by three. Speed up by one. Oh, baby! Guts up by three. Oh, baby! Vitality up by three. Lock up by one. Sweet! Maximum HP went up by 43. I can't handle it anymore! PP up by one. Oh, my God! It's amazing! HP is maxed out, and we continue on. Huh, <sighs> what a level up that was. Good lord. I need a break. I need to rest after that. You back off there. I don't want to have to fight all of you. Let's see. Excuse me, excuse me. Do I go this way? Maybe I... No, I don't go that way. Okay, but now he's kind of like swam over there on his little trajectory. Okay, that's good. Yeah, you just you just stay over there. You stay over there. You stay over there. Oh, there's something there. There's something else there. There's a it's the money money statue. Yeah, you you just you just stay back there. I yeah. There we go. Yes, perfect. So what is your story, buddy? I'm the evil part of your brain. You can't beat me, because you are the one who forced me into being. Ness's nightmare attacked. This guy is a pain in the rear. He might already have like a, a shield around him too. I don't know for sure. No, he doesn't. Okay. But he casts Shazam too. You can Shazam too. So pretty much the idea here is to outlast him. Oh God. Oh, oh, oh Lord. Oh, that doesn't sound pleasant at all. Oh, he's protected by the power shield now. Get my sh get uh, get myself recovered here. Okay, that's fine. And yeah, we're just gonna have to eat these attacks. There's no, there's really no, no other way around it. Oh, don't smash! That's just gonna hurt. <laughs> okay, but at least I took care of it. Um, let's, yeah, let's actually, let's actually heal up our. Ooh, bad, 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 bad. Okay, that, <laughs> that stopped the bleeding. Good. Okay, Shazam Alpha is not terrible. It still hurts, but yeah, it's... Okay, he's... He's not maxing out his life, which is an important thing to note. Oh, stop doing that! Stop it! 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 Okay, that actually did not kill me. Mmm! Right in your face! Right in... Your your featureless, expressionless face. Ooh, that that could have been bad. I forget what glorious light does. Obviously, not anything good. I don't think. Ah, oh, just mess. No, Ness, don't do that. Come on, we're so close. We're so close. Uh oh, no, oh, he's he 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 must be scared now because he's just doing nothing but protecting himself. I'm just gonna keep chipping him down. Don't okay. Phew. Probably a good a good thing that we're uh, equipped with this earth pendant. Oh, come on. Yeah. Yeah. That's bad. That's very bad. Okay, that's better. Okay, I'm not worried yet. Try bashing him one more time here. Just gained a lot of X or, uh, HP back. Alright, let's heal. It's a good thing I'm doing it. Because he's about ready to unleash nuclear, nuclear devastation upon me with his mind. Alright. Anyway, fortunately, uh, Life Up Gamma 
uh, does just just simply flat out maxes out your life, which is good. Power shield deflected. I'm slowly chipping away at that life up. Ugh. Okay, the shield's gone. And he's recovering a lot of HP, but now I've got full... I've got a full blast on... Ooh, speaking of full blasts... Recover! Recover! That's fine, he's just wasting... wasting offensive power on me. Because I'm already bleeding out. Yeah, Shazam Alpha, I don't care about. You can do that to me all day, if you want to. Whatever. Okay. Ooh! That's it. Is that it? No, that's not it. Uh-oh. 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 No. 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 How much PP do you have? It did not work on Ness? What? Am I actually standing up to this thing? Am I telling him he has no control over me? He has no power over me? I am the superior force in this universe. You hear me? You stupid golden statue that kind of looks like an Oscar, but isn't? What? Dodged quickly? How does a statue dodge quickly? How? Yeah, how does a statue dodge? I call... I, I call foul on that one. Oh. No more nuclear disaster! Please! I don't want this anymore! <gasps> He's out of ammo. A smile crossed his lips as he selected Bash. Beat the remaining stuffing out of you, you gold-flecked little creep. Yes! Stop moving! Ha ha ha! You won 89,000 XPs. Level 69! All right! Offense up by one, IQ up by one, HP up by one, PP up by four. You know what? That's fine by me. Ness heard a familiar voice at the center of the Sea of Eden. Gigas' goal is to destroy you. Listen carefully. Everything in the universe could be destroyed at the hands of Gigas, but he and his followers are also in trouble. The Apple of Enlightenment has foretold that Gigas' attempt will fail. It is because of the existence of a boy named Ness. That's me. Listen. Free your mind and know what you must do. Your destiny has already been decided. You, I... Where should we go? You know, deep within the reaches of your mind. S -sa Saturn? Saturn Valley. Yes! Go to the valley where the Mr. Saturn live. You'll get something new there. Soon, Magicant will be no more. We must be quick. Ness really heard his own voice. Go to Saturn Valley! Go to Saturn Valley now! Get them! Get on the chopper! Mm -hmm. <gasps> Ness was filled with the power of the giant step! Ness's speed increased by five! Ness's vitality increased by five! Ness was filled with the power of the Lilliput steps! Ness's guts increased by five. Ness's luck increased by five. Ness was filled with the power of the Milky Well. Speed up by five. IQ up by five. Filled with the power of the Magnet Hill. Vitality increased by five. Luck increased by five, and all metallic objects suddenly stuck to his face. <laughs> Ness was filled with the power of the Rainy Circle. Guts increased by five. IQ increased by five. The power of the Pink Cloud. Speed up by five. Guts up by five. The power of the Lumine Hole. Luck up by five. IQ up by five. And finally, the power of the Fire Spring gives us speed up by five and luck up by five. Instantly, Ness's mind cleared, and he realized that he had possessed great power. At that moment, Ness's psychic powers radically expanded. Ness gained 200,000 experience points. Ness's level is now 70. Offense up by one. Luck up by one. Sweet! HP went up by 149. That rocks! PP went up by 330. 
Ness realized the power of life up Omega. Ness is level 71. Offense up by 2. Luck up by 1. HP up by 3. <laughs> PP up by 1. Yeah, I know. It seems a little lackluster after all that juicing up I just did from the sanctuaries. And finally, he realized he had the power of teleport beta. And Pooh just kind of sat off to the side going, I knew that from the beginning. Ness made all of the hidden powers his own. Ness absorbed the power of the land into his heart, and Magicant was no more. Now you can wake up. Your friends are waiting for you. It is time to get up. Uh-oh. Uh, mild seizure warning for anybody who is, uh, <laughs> who is sensitive to this. It's about to get crazy in here. Don't look directly at it. Oh, boy. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, dude. Go, oh, big bucks, no whammies. Big bucks, no whammies. Stop. The soundstone that Ness used to have is now gone. <gasps> what happened, Ness? You've been unconscious for a long time. You kept saying something. Saturn Valley? What's waiting for us there? Anyway, we need to teleport. Oh. Oh, I was about to say, uh, where, uh, do you want me to do that? <laughs> and here we are in Saturn Valley! And, oh. Dr. Andonuts is here. There's Apple Kid. And there's a uh, Gerardo Montague, and what the heck is that machine? <laughs> we'll find out in the next video. That's what we'll do, because that was a long one. So thanks to everyone for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. We're coming up to the end of this here, kids, I think. So, until next time, I've been Educated, and now so have you. See you later. Can we